How do you feel the structure of the program has improved their learning? Um, I think having a, sort of a free day offer and being able to give them the opportunity to do an employability qualification, a work placement, and a vocational qualification as well, specific to the, the industry they want to work within, has really helped. It's, it's been mapped out for them. They, they were very clear from the beginning what they were doing, when they were doing it, um, and that structure has been able to give them that that opportunity to come in um, at a set time and have that routine. Um, I think the good thing was that um, John and Freddie, they made it, and yourself of course, made it so enjoyable for us because I've been on other courses where the job center is sent into and it's like, you know, they send you to computer course and no one's there to help you. And if you're not um, computer literate like I'm, <laughs> you, you kind of struggle. Right now we're going to check on a few of the boys that are on the soccer schools around the AstroTurf. So we've got Dermot, Dermot, well done. So you're on the um, term time. Yeah, we're on the term time. So our soccer schools during the half time. So how do you find it? It's really good. Yeah, really good work on the answers, you know. I can see some Ingram potentials, yeah. you know, from them. So you yeah. and Raheem Sterling, I'm guessing. Yeah, I can see a couple of them, man. Really, I, I can see natural abilities with some of them youngsters. You know, they're probably about six to eight year old, but they definitely got So, uh, what about you yourself? You good at football? I used to be a good little part footballer. I used to be able to fly away. That's right. That's right. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. 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 Right, the chest for that direction. Yes. That's me. 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 That's what do you feel the program has brought to the group? Um, I feel the program has, has really united the, the guys that are on the, on the program and uh, that have enrolled since, since the beginning. Um, I believe that because of the opportunity that's been offered for them to come in and, and engage in a work placement and be able to uh, sit vocational qualifications and, and give them the confidence to move into work. I feel that it's just giving them a new lease of life. I think John's mentioned before about getting back on the bike and it's probably the best way to describe it because realistically for a lot of the guys that are with us, they haven't had that opportunity previously and now they have and, and it, is, it has given them newfound confidence. Oh. Well, I've been out of work for a while, but my goal is really to try and get back into what I love doing. And, that, and I said, come in here. Uh, well, I'll tell you what, um, in the three days I've been like, in the three weeks, I'm not really a, a bad person to get out of bed early, yeah. but before I know I'm coming here, yeah. I'm up an hour early. Yeah. You, what have you gained? Well, I haven't done a first aid course for a long while um, since I worked for British Rail in the 80s, 90s. And I you had a first aid course, and I was very pleased to do that because you never know when it might come in handy to save someone's life or disease. So we've checked the Astro Surf, checked Love Grub, and we're over to the club for the ticket office. How do you think the course has been so far? I can announce if we had another three more weeks, I would come back. <laughs> I can know, I can I enjoy my job. I learn a lot more here than all the courses I've been on. And that and I like the way you and what I like about here is the assistance, the help you get. Anyway, we don't get that, we can give them something and let them get on with it. So I appreciate all that they've done a lot. Yeah. What was your main goal before starting this, this course? And have you achieved it or come close to achieving it? 
to be honest, part of my main goal was to get away from the job centre for a while and come at this. Um, yes, I've achieved a lot because it, it, it's good to be ref to be, have a refresher yeah. and the actual confidence mixing with other people. So I think I've achieved that. Now, well, uh, now I feel more confident than what I feel. I, I, I will kind of always be knocked back, knocked back, now I do keep getting knocked back and thinking, uh, I don't want to go on. Yeah. This has gave me lower you know, uh, like keep going. Like, yeah. Don't give up. Yeah. You know, keep going. Uh, sooner or later, a door will open. Yeah. You know, so that's what I get. Yeah. What's been your most memorable part of the course? Memorable, yeah. Teaching. The teaching. The teaching and the knowledge that yeah. I didn't know before. So the employability session is that yeah. now. Go ahead, go on. So, your brother is six years old. Okay. Yeah. You are half his age. Half his age, yeah. How old are you when he turns 100? <laughs> My brother is six years old, I'm half his age, so that makes me three. <laughs> how old are you when he. How old. Is it how old? Yeah, how old are you when, when he, you're 100? Alright. I'm half his age, I've assisted. Half, half, half of the hundred and sixty. Five. Um, Four. Ninety-seven. Three. Three. Yes, you got it. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it took me. I just played for time. Yeah. <laughs> now your answer is ninety-seven. Ninety-seven? Yeah. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 yeah.